Y'all know that I stream from Cartridge. <laughs> Let's see. Hard. There we go. Wait, hold on, no. Yeah, there we go. Now we're doing more Lufia. This is absolutely Lufia. Hey June, hey Millie, how's it going? Love the hip hop version of the song. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> Oops, I pressed the button. I'm just building up my. Start I'm building up my self confidence and feeling good about myself. Here we go. Let's see. It's really hard, but I think it goes here. Gotta go here. I think it's up here. Yeah, it is. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Oh, shoot, we got more pieces. Let's see, let's put this one right here. Yeah. Yeah, look at Birdie here. Birdie, Birdie right here. There we go. Let's see. There we go. Right here. We got two more pieces. We can do it. This is pre-show, by the way. <laughs> Y'all hadn't figured that out yet. <laughs> this is me having a good, good amount of fun. Whew. Start All right, do that. We get to race some birdie. All right, racing birdie. We got, we got press the button really fast. We got to just like pound on this button. You got pound this button. There we go. Oh, ooh, there we go. Perfect. Right, we gotta go to the farm, then to the mill, and then to the station. That's got a lot of us today, huh? Hold on. That doesn't work. You know what? Actually, I hadn't had a chance to see anything really today. I've been out for most of the day. And this morning I had really no signal, and then the rest of the day I was actually like out. I took my little brother out, and we were like, yo, we're escaping for a little bit. No, we're good. Yeah, we're fine. I'm good. I'm just... I was like, yo. I needed it. There we go. Yeah, we did it. There we go, watch it go. 
you know, I'm perfectly fine. I just like, yo, it was a, uh, not like a rough day, just like a, mmm. Couple things to do, but I'm alright. So I actually just got home like at like six ish. I did go get some food though, so it was all good. I got a burger. I got a birthday burger, because I, I had a birthday coupon. So I went ahead and used it. Because it's like almost into the month, so like I had to use this stuff now. <laughs> All right, there he is, is it Sir Topham Hat? You forgot about the side quest in Luffy? I did, yeah, it's a... It's a different kind of side quest. Alright, we're gonna pound this button again. We gotta race Percy. I'm actually going to skip the, uh... The story... The story mode. The, the story time thing. Yeah. We gotta race... We gotta race this, race this green... This green fucker. This is Percy. His engine number is six. Pop quiz, what is the uh, first, uh, what is the first uh, story of the series? Uh, what engine does it star? I'll give you the answer soon. I know what I just, you know. You gotta know the names of the, of the engines. We're actually gonna skip this one. We're just gonna go straight to the quiz. Oh, the answer is number t is uh, engine number two, Edward. All right, how many buses do we count? <laughs> it's one. We got four people. All right, all right. Final all right, question. What color is Birdie? Birdie is the bus on the road, for those who don't know. They're, uh, Thomas, they're, uh... They're, uh, Thomas the Tank Engine. Hmm... I know it's really hard, isn't it? <laughs> hmm. This one's hard. It's supposed to be a house. <laughs> and Thomas is pulling coaches. There we go. See? Perfect. We did it. <laughs> we completed the quiz. Alright. Okay, enough of this. Uh, I'll be right back. I'll go ahead and change I'll go ahead and change Lufia. <laughs> and give me one sec while I do that. Alright, without warning, island appeared in the sky. Hopefully no one dies.
we were in Genoba. Insomniac. Oh good, you made it in time while we were actually doing Lufia now. And not like doing uh, Thomas the Tank Engine, which I was doing a little bit of to tease the audience and to edge, edge them on into here. Because really the hook is me playing Thomas the Tank Engine. <laughs> the SNES. I check some. Okay, good news. I think we're actually good on. I think the buckler might be the only really thing to get. That's good. Yeah. All right, good. So we're at this island. There's actually like a red tower, blue tower, and a green tower to take on here for uh, multiple things. We're about to do a couple of trips through these. Let's see. So that will increase... I'll keep him the same. I think I have him as a long sword right now. He has an axe right now. She has a rape. Oh, no, I did not get the rapier for her. I just skipped it. Okay. So we're all right here for the most part. Three towers. Oh yeah, I, I I remember them now. Because when I did my little playthrough of this, I actually got I did get through the three towers. From a while back. And I already talked to this lady, she told us to uh, do stuff in the towers. I know what I'm doing, and we won't die too much. Here we go. That is a blue tower. So yeah, uh, apologies, June. This uh, this is gonna be a lot of blue background. At least they're color coded. Only one of the towers is kind of bad. That's good to know. Just like Dragon Quest, we can fall out of the tower back onto the world map by just stepping off. Green Jade. So, uh, 
actually found that pretty quick. Yo. Okay, these gargoyles, these gargoyles are rad. By the way, Polly, I did see you before. I, I, I don't know if I said hi to you or not, but I did see you before. Hey, how's it going? How you doing? Screen kept. That feels, that feels right. My least favorite enemy type so far. These guys over here. Because they kill me too fast. Oh, we got him. We got him for once. Alright. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Level 21, huh? Okay. Dang. That's a little, that's a little, uh, a little light there. <laughs> For now, since we're just kind of fighting on the world map. Main thing killing me so far with this game is the uh, random encounters. Oh, awesome, thanks, June. It is more the random encounters, less the boss. Like the boss fights haven't really been killing me. I say that just like you know, it'll, it'll backfire eventually. But it's mostly been the random encounters that have uh, been all of my deaths so far, except for that one bo that one boss with the three goblins. That was that was a fluke. Jump weed. Jaren seems to be going faster, actually. Jump weed. Weed. Hey, J hey, Liana. Oh, you got an airship? Awesome. 
Hmm, watching my drops. I have like a 4.6% right now, but it's not... Okay, it's going... It's going lower. Okay. People. Getting poisoned, getting hurt. Gotta do the healing. Um, we've done floor four of the old cave. That was what we did. Well, we did that last time, actually. We did floor four. I know it changes based on how strong you get, so, like, you know, how deep you can go, but I, I forget the, uh, I don't know the actual level requirements for that. worry about these archers doing like a high arrow because they tend to do that on me and it hurts a lot more chomp wheats. She's out of bang. Yeah. 
You're not supposed to chomp the weed. You're supposed to smoke it. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> I guess you can smoke it. This is a song about that. All right, fortunately, this, uh... Horror Quinn. I have a feeling we're about to get clowned. A bite is a dark type move, that's right. Are we a light type? Anyway, Liana is right. Uh, bite is a dark type move, so. He might be a fire type. No, what does he have? He has a uh, he has a uh, support magic only. Yeah, we're dry. We are very dry and have entered this dungeon, and we might be in a, uh, we might be in a very precarious situation. Craig Stadler? Craig Stadler, what advice do you have? It's Craig Stadler. Craig Stadler, you think I should go to the room on the east? I, th I think I should go to the room on the east. There might be something to help us uh, with this situation. Uh oh. Luffy has been stoned. Agro has been stoned. I hope they recover from that. They don't. Huh. Well, there is an end right here. <laughs> Strange, but the same guest always comes, so I do well here. Hundred fifty for this end, but you know, there you go. They're still stoned, though. Hmm. Shoot. Hmm. 
They are still stoned. Mm. I'm pretty sure I know how to heal that is at the uh, place. Oh, did I do a stone cure? Hold on. Time to walk back. There we go. Are these gargoyles? They stone. Are you kidding? on our buttons to cycle items. Okay, that's good. You also do it with the left and right, that's cool. <laughs> well, I was like, no, we're, we're gonna laugh at Tom for this. Right, the second. Good at bowling. I guess the question is, would you, if, if you had to invite somebody to the Space Jam, and they had to be all JRPG characters, would Pierre be one of the characters you invite to the Space Jam? Y'all wouldn't take... You'd invite Dogie to the Space Jam? I I'd invite Dogie to the Space Jam. Adol would not be invited to the Space Jam, huh? Dogies coming to the Space Jam. Who else would come to the Space Jam? It, it, the Space Jam had to happen again. And the Looney Tunes were all out. I, I would count Charles Barkley. However, remember that Barkley's powers were used in the original Space Jam.
Jaren's taking a nap. So I wonder if Barkley could reuse his abilities in the second, in the great, in the second Great Space Jam. I don't know. All right. You know what? I'm just gonna use your revive. Nothing's stopping me. Persona 3 MC? I, I think I can agree with that. Oh, wait, no. Or is that Persona 4? Hold on. Is that... Is that the uh, PSP? Is it the PSP version? June, go eat. The answer of who will be in our space jam will come to you. So we got Dogie and Ryan. Is it? Wait. No, it's uh, it's Kendo. It's Kendo swimming and something else. It's not basketball though, because Persona Four has basketball. Basketball and soccer are Persona Four. Kendo swimming and then something else. I forget what that something else was, but I know it wasn't basketball. And it wasn't tennis. That's in the, uh, that's in Persona 3 Portable. But yeah, I know it's soccer and basketball. And a co- yeah, co is a, uh... Yeah, yeah, co is from, uh, four. Okay, I'll accept him. He's allowed. It, it has to be, uh... It has to be the Persona 4 MC. I agree. If we if were to pull somebody in, we have to. However, I think we also have to pull Demi Fiend. Demi Fiend might have to be also be in there too. We are, we are kind of filling this up with too many SMT characters, so we have to think outside the box here. Though I know actual basketball are in there, or, you know, actual basketball exists in their, in their universes. I'm going to pick a Nina from Breath of Fire. From a Breath of Fire. I'm not sure which one, though. It's true. There are a lot of there's a basketball teams are big. 
I'm not sure which Nina. Probably one that can fly. So which Dragoon do we pick? Um, I gotta think about which Nina I'm gonna pick too, because it's probably Breath of Fire 1 Nina, because she can actually fly. The other Ninas can only hover. Like, Breath of Fire 2 Nina can only hover. Because the uh, the winged race in, in Breath of Fire uh, lost their abilities to fly. But uh, Brother Fire 1 Dina can fly. What's the Dragoon's name from Final Fantasy 2? Not not North American 2, but uh but FF2, uh, you know, Japanese Final Fantasy 2. Trying to think of their name. Yeah, Kane will play for the other team eventually. So we can't do Kane. There's a Dragoon in, uh, in, uh, in FF2. I forget her name. I think it's her. I think so. I guess I could pay him. <laughs> Great useless inspirational advice from Aizen. Yeah, we have a fight in the end. This inn has a random encounter rate, which is rad. He'd be like, you have to grasp the ball with your with both your hands out in front of you. You must take hold of it, and you must strive to become the to toss the ball where you want it to be, and where you want to be it as well. That, that was my that was my best eyes and impression. That's all I got for y'all. I make fun of Aizen out of love, because Aizen is funny. Aizen is good. Bowser's good at dunking.
Oh no, I'm I'm discussing it. I'm we're we're, we're making a team. We're making a team. I, I'm just trying to figure. I'm just trying to think of names. The stream's gonna be known as the moment that we came up with the uh, come up with the uh, the next space the, the next true space jam, not the false space jam. It's like, uh, of course, it's also thinking like space jam is an actual thing that needs to be, like you know, re reverenced or something. I don't know. Bit. It's a good bit, though. There we go. So, obviously Robo. Just as an ob obvious Robo and Alia. A Robo and Alia. That's it. That's, that's, the, that's the choice. If I'm, if I'm putting, if I'm putting someone, it, it's Ayla. It's Ayla for sure. Feral, Feral Woman. They got a good they got a good power hit in the game for a double tech, but uh Ayla's also rad, so you know, like one of my favorite party members. Alright, we have a new town here. <laughs> Wait, the lake has become a toxic marsh. We can't plan it anymore. You can plan the toxic marsh, girl, it's okay. Oh, there's a save point here too? Holy crap! It's not my power. This place is a strong natural energy. All right, y'all. Actually, real quick, I will be right back. I'm gonna take a quick restroom break. I can take a quick bathroom break. I'll be right back. So give me one moment while I do that real quick.
Alright, I needed that. Just double check in here. Oh yeah, uh, Craig Stabler's still here. Oops. <laughs> oh, I should not mute myself. I should probably put myself back in performance mode, though. Because it sounds better. Alright. Alright. There we go. The Water Fairy lived in the Red Tower, but no one has seen her since the Dark Ghost appeared. Oh boy. That sounds friendly. Someone tells me we'll be dealing with that Dark Ghost. A knife. Hey June, also welcome back. I see you got potatoes. Mm, we gotta fix that. Thought there was something there. I have too many things. Oh no, I have to sell things. Okay, um. Are, you're saying that rubies are red sapphires? That's right. Rubies and sapphires are exactly the same. The red ones are rubies. Or rubies. The other colors are sapphires. Rubies and sapphires are the same. Hmm, I didn't know that. So, do you know rubies are sapphires? Hmm, mines of Medan. bottle. <laughs> Liana wants to hold... Liana wants all those elixirs at the end of the game. All in one spot, ready to be used at any point. I do have 99 potions right here, but I have been using them for, like, healing. Alright, we gotta warp somewhere. We have to go back to Medan. We have to go back to this town. Because we need to go up here. She said the gem mine of Medan. Yeah, we're going there. Back where the frogs need to probably get some of that weed. There we go. I 
should have played that song. That's alright. Same battle. Yeah, you want to use those instead because they, uh, they get, yeah, you only have a limited number of casts in, uh, FF1. Unless you're playing the GBA version, then that's different. Sapphires. Oh, yes, we used to mine plenty back in the old days. The old man at the end might still have one. Yeah, we're, we're back to these enemies. Okay, so yeah, you're not, you're not using spell charges. Just fine. Yeah, that's good luck, Volcano. The ground is lava and the... I don't know. <laughs> Something happens. I just bang him. The only game I'm allowed to say, screw it, just bang him. <laughs> Yo, crazy pot. Used by a uh, pot of greed. Seventy years I've been mining rubies. My whole life has been spent on rubies. Does <laughs> so we really need rubies? Are you are you sure there's no more root in here? Why do you need rubies? I mean, they need something called Artea. Artea, the Artea of Doom Island. You know about them? Every one of my generation knows about Artea. Why do you want to see him? We need the Sinistrals. The Sinistrals? Hmm. Wait. I'll give you the ruby I've been saving. Take this one. It's the Hope Ruby. The Kingdom of Medan depended on rubies. I thought that Medan would die without it, so I kept the real one here. Of course, a fake one was used after that. Perhaps there wasn't a reason to keep this one. So, if you remember that ruby quest, this is the real ruby. From way back. If I could wish on the hope ruby, I'd ask that the Sinistrals never reappear. It's the best. I found it in 70 years. I want you to have it. Okay. I'm going to your back room, though. And I'm raiding the rest of your chests. I'm even checking these boxes. And then I'm warping out in front of your face. Oh, 
かね<laughs> Oh, this town doesn't have a safe Oh, no, it does. It's over here. Check this place real quick. Okay. Nothing there. Okay. I ain't gonna pay the fifty. The fifty. I know it's, it's 50, so I just don't have a... I'm not high enough level yet to unlock that next area. That's all right. So back to Ruin. Ruon. Not, not Ruin. Ruon. here, but I, let me see here. Found a flea? Stop, June. Don't do it. Okay, it's alright. That's fair. The flea shall become some. S However, June, if you do let the flea live, it's going to become some sort of mascot later. And your story. It'll tell your story. It'll tell its story and yours. It'll sell the movie rights to like DreamWorks or Disney. And do you really want your uh, story to be told by Disney? I didn't think so. I would say Blue Sky, but they got bought by Disney. <laughs> the Blue Sky? Is that what they call it? Or am I thinking of the, of the uh, developer? The Genesis developer, Blue Sky. No, no, it is Blue Sky. We all want, we all want our movie to be made by Studio Trigger. Okay, yeah, that's what I'm thinking of. There's a develop there's a developer on the Genesis. Uh, 
people who made Genesis games that is called Blue Sky Software. But they're different. Oh. Shoot. That was a mistake. Tom has stepped off the tower. Yeah, they did a little bit of academia. Leon, I know you. I know you're pull up. And they know you pull your. Oh, yeah. I know you pull your clothes off all the time, so you'll be good for trigger. <laughs> yes. I believe so. I think so. I actually own. I actually own a copy of Promare. I still haven't watched it yet. Yeah, Insomniac. I, I accidentally stepped off the tower. <laughs> Which is what I do. That's not good. Goblins are pretty cool. Pierre looks stronger. All right. Okay, I'm going to just use this for five again because I keep getting him. The occasional death is fine. Potions can I stuff down an elf girl's throat? That's gross. Wait a minute. Friend who went to art school. Bam. Goals. doing something. Awesome.
where I was. Let's walk around the tower a little bit and don't fall off. We gotta take care of them fast. We're gonna do another potion chugging contest. Those are just called big beanies. Crap, they cast bang. They can bang me. I know the punchline to this. Lucky chunk. Here we go. Alright. Let's check something real fast. To the item list. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see some items. In use, I think I might be needing to use some stuff. Hmm. That's all I need to see. Potion is intelligence. Power strength, okay.
Who are you? This tower is mine. Did that dreaded water fairy send you? I hate intruders. Scream. Also, this boss theme. Still really good. Oh, that's a death for Agro. It's probably death for all of us, actually. Uh oh. I'm just gonna let that happen. Yeah, that was a. Uh... All right. It's only 10, 10 gold here, so that's all right. So I might need you to get some potions. Screamed at us, I have a blue house and a blue window, and just like went for it. Oh, no, that means it's time for some grinding music.
It's okay, I'm not gonna play the usual ones that I've been playing before, so... You know, but, you know, we'll just be... We'll be hanging... Hanging out is what I meant. Oh, we're ambushed already, isn't that great?
Usually I am pretty careful with the music, um, though I, I do just, you know, do a little bit. I wish I could do more. I am usually, I am usually pretty careful with the, with the music, though. Usually with, like, stuff no one cares about, hopefully. <laughs> but yeah, no, I do, I do know about it. Ugh. I would use more of it if I could, if I kind of could. Oh yeah, the, the the Wayne's World one is most likely fine. Not sure about the Eiffel 65 one, but it's okay. Eiffel 65 is hyped someone played a song other than Blue. <laughs> uh, actually, I do have a funny story about <laughs> about my console. Um, I knew a guy in the Air... <laughs> I knew a guy in the Air Force I was actually pretty good friends with. Uh, he, he told me he told me one day that when he was younger, uh, he had uh, performed a full dance routine and sing in a singing routine to my console by Eiffel 65 on stage in middle school when he was and I was like this is either the dorkiest thing ever or the coolest fucking thing possible <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was the coolest thing possible <laughs> because uh because I definitely know I, I definitely know how uh he yeah, I definitely know how he got laid in the Air Force in tech school, so. <laughs> I will say it was, it was cool. So, yeah. Oh, no, he definitely did the best, probably the best way possible. <laughs> Hope he's alright. He got state, if I remember right, he got stationed in Okinawa after tech school, so. Take that as it goes. Those are my, uh, those are my Air Force stories, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, Tom's telling Air Force stories, so, Tom's telling Air Force stories on stream again. Someone tell him to stop. All I'll say is that tech school had some stuff. Stop. <laughs> hey, turtle, how's it going? Dirk. That's one of those days, huh? Yeah, one of those days. I know. I know the feeling. 
I got uh, tur uh, turtle. I got dragged out to Amish. Uh, I'm gonna say this in a way that you'll understand. I got dragged out to Amish country again to put Tambor on a put Tambor on a horse and buggy. <laughs> one of those days. <laughs> and then uh, I, I, I took Trace out. <laughs> I took Trace out. And we got we got burgers. Any, honestly, I don't like having any. Yeah, yeah, Tatter has collateral on me. It, it's fine. I don't have any like embarrassing like personal ones. I just remember band. I just remember band stuff. Because uh, Tatter, tur Turtle, ta Turtle combats my brother. Okay. <laughs> um, say hi to him. His his name is Tyler. Uh, but anyway, he uh. He's, he's two years younger than I, I was, so we, we were in band together. That's all I really got. Though. I don't have I don't have any weird, embarrassing stories. Too much. If I get reminded, I, I I could tell something, but he probably has more on me. Here in sentences from, from Turtle. Oh boy. That's all right. That's how it works sometimes. So yo, Tata, we, we were jamming to Eiffel 65's uh, My Console. Uh, what other what other fun? I'm not gonna play any more music, I think. But what other fun music do we got? Oh shoot. Oh shoot. That that song that song is great. We're talking about British punk 90 90s punk band Chumbawamba. Uh yo good ship lifestyle. I that's a song. I might play that later for myself. As a kid, like a five, like as, when I was like five, six, seven, and eight, I used to be really into pop music. I, I used to be really into pop music, just as one would probably be. Like pop music was like something I I liked a lot of, and I kind of stopped like entire like there, but like you know, like I like all kinds of music though. So like anything that would come my way listening to uh, it was just kind of a 
Yo, I, I'd listen to it. I'd listen to a lot of music. Young, growing up, and then I kind of got out of it later on, and then just back into it. I listen to anything. Really. So, like, punk is good. Tears is as punk as you get. That's a uh, pretty light. I mean, it's okay. Tears for Fears. I, I like Tears for Fears. It's not really punk, though. It's alright, though. effect. Two point five of the punk meter. Thing is, would it be? Would it be doing the punk? Like, basically, what you're thinking is is the music getting punked or is the music doing the punking? Two point five out of hundred. <laughs> um, live fast, die whenever. I don't think I've listened. I have not listened to that. Okay. Send, send it to me whenever you get the chance. And I will give it a listen. So this is also the Tyler, the turtle. Um, the, the song that's been in my head all day is the, uh, the, the Jim Stafford, you know, the, uh, the Jim Stafford uh, Wildwood Flower song. I don't know why, it's just been in my head all day. I'm not saying I should I could go for some wildwood flower, but you know. It's just how it works sometimes. I will I will post that song into uh, into Twitter. Someone remind me. Get a lot of confusion. Spent the rest of the day and the most of that night trying to find my brother Bill. <laughs> Came across him. The next morning, naked, singing on the windmill. He said he flew up there. <laughs> had to fly, had to fly up there <laughs> to get him back down. That's a song about getting high on the farm. There we go. 
but level 20. That's good. Still doing that. I know, y'all, the grind, the grind's a bit much. Um, I did find... I will say this. I did find another game genie code for this game. I can tell this game to behave later. It sounds like a more useful one than the one I found before. I know that song. Yep. Yep, I, I know that song. I got your link, June. I will listen to that after the stream. Go looking around for a possible if we if we need to use it for speeding up this game a little bit. I don't mind doing that for stream. It's um I found one that actually earns you a level up after every battle. <laughs> you were a nudist who came in to use the phone. get like 21 as a uh, insomniac said to maybe get luffy at a level 21 something tells me that that's a thing that might actually be useful here Does that spell spark? So I've seen spark used already on uh, on us. I bet it's spark, isn't it? I bet Jaren probably learns uh, stronger as well. Probably. Work on her a little bit. I could probably also go to the, uh, go ahead and go to the, um, the old cave now. Let's see what they have. bit of a extra new site. Ah, damn. I've had a few drop I've had a few frame drops tonight, but it's not been too bad at least. Let's see. We'll probably make this a little bit shorter one tonight, but I'm gonna go ahead and do the old cave. And then what I might do is uh, do maybe a little bit of off-screen grinding, and then uh, come back to y'all probably uh, next time we uh, play here. We'll probably be ready for this boss fight then. Is what I'm thinking. Because we've made we still made progress today. Get to these towers, but it is about 11:30, so I think we're gonna go ahead and do this first if, if we're good here, and then uh, we'll probably stop after the after the old cave and be selling the stuff in the old cave.
His main character hit level 20. We should be alright now, I think. Alright, Golden Pond. Simulator on PS5. The honest teasing. Farming. I'm more of a gr I'm more of a bump and grind kind of person. Though I do like Rune Factory, that has both farming and grinding in both ways. Okay, that was the stupidest joke I could make. Thank you. damage. that way, do I? I'm not that, I'm not that bad, am I? I hope I'm not that bad. At least I hope I'm not that bad. Shoot. Yeah, sorry, no, that's right. No, June just wants me to smuggle him overseas, that's right. I swear, though, when international shipping goes down... No, June, you're not living in the fridge. So Trace's school gave him a whole bunch of applesauce this week. So if you like cherry applesauce, please come. Please come and take the cherry applesauce from the fridge. Tamber actually likes the cherry applesauce, so I'll give it to her. I, I'm not a fan, but, you know, I, I ain't gonna knock it, you know, if other people like, you know, if other people like it, I'm not gonna be like, yo. Now, one time they gave them, the, like, this... Was it birthday cake-flavored applesauce? And I smelled it, and I was like... This is the worst thing I've ever smelled in my life. <laughs> it's not, actually, but it is, like... It, it was bad.
I was like, oh. It's like, what are they serving to these children? I'm like, did we eat this as kids? No, I don't think it was this... Was it this bad? Maybe it was this bad, I just don't remember it. Make sure my fridge is empty before June gets here so I can so I can keep them in the fridge. <laughs> sorry, sorry June. Liana's in the closet already, so I, I have to I have to make room elsewhere. Unless you want to share room with Liana. I think level 25 you can go to the next floor, so we keep coming back to the old cave and do more of those more of those quests in there. Let's warp all the way back to where we were before first. Just so I don't lose my position. <laughs> Kind of a short one tonight, but uh, I think we'll go. I'll go ahead and stop here for tonight since uh, I'm level 20, level 19 so far. I, I might want to gain a couple more levels before I try to fight that boss again, so I think I'll do that on my own. And then we'll just kind of continue from there uh, next time. So, yeah, I think we'll stop there for tonight. I'm tired too, actually. Like, yo, I'm doing the thing. Yo, June, that artwork's freaking good. Holy crap. Holy crap. Jeez. Holy shit. Okay. That's really good. I can't show y'all because it's a. It's June's into me. But I'm like, yo. <laughs> I just saw it. I was like, yo. That's rad. But anyway, yeah, no, thank you all for uh, still coming out and just watching this smaller stream. Uh, we'll continue the towers next time and uh, push through this boss fight. <laughs> yeah, it's the album art. I'm not sure who else June has shown it to, so I'm going to hold off on that. It's really good, though. But, yeah. Y'all go ahead. And I will let y'all know, too. Um... As far as uh, how, how far we are into the game here, uh, there are 50 areas on this world map that I have. And 
And we are... Uh, Red Tower is actually area 24. So, doing there. And there's a couple of there's a couple of extra areas on this map, I believe. So, there you go. That's how far we are. <laughs> so, yep. Y'all have a good rest of the evening, and uh, take care. We'll be back... If not this weekend with Lufia, then on Monday, I'll, I might do like another stream this weekend or something just for fun. It may be like not Lufia. It might be something else. I don't know yet. We'll, I'll see what I feel like. The one third mark. Okay. That's what I may be thinking too. But uh, I'm giving everybody hope. <laughs> but the real Lufia begins. <laughs> but anyway, thank y'all. Y'all have a good rest of the evening. And take care. <laughs>